Hey guys, how you doing? This is my reaction video to um, the latest episode of Doctor Who, The Waters of Mars. I just finished watching it on YouTube because it aired in England. It hasn't come here yet, stateside yet, I don't think. But even if it did, I couldn't watch it anyway because uh, I don't have TV. Any hoozle. Um, awesome episode. I thought it was... Oh yeah, I guess I should, before I go on, I should say that... Um, spoilers. There's going to be spoilers. Awesome episode. Brilliant. Loved it. Fantastic. Multi Benny. All that good stuff. I thought it was really great how they showed um, just how far wrong the Doctor's grief of being alone takes him. I mean, the way they handled his... You could just tell his grief. And he, he thought he had it together with being last of the Time Lords. He sets the rules. But he realizes he's wrong when, you know, after Adelaide shoots herself, um, just, he, realize what he, he realizes what he did. I thought it was an absolutely brilliant moment. The, the build-up to the last two episodes is just, oh, it gives me all an edge. It's awesome. Um, seeing... It's kind of weird how with Ud Sigma showing up, I don't know if it, they, I guess they meant that to be vague, but it's probably, I don't know if that was physically Ud Sigma there, I think it was probably just more of a, his conscience bugging him. I actually don't have too much to say about the episode itself, but I have more to say about the trailer that they showed for the end of time. And that was just mind-boggling. So many little things that they threw in there. It's just, oh, I, Christmas can't come soon enough. Um, it was just, oh, I mean, everything from Donna, Wilfred, Ood, some guy who we don't know, Lucy Saxon is in there, and of course, obviously, the master. Um, it's just, there's so much in there, and yet it, every shot that they show you, every little spoiler they give you, um... This just leads to a whole slew of questions. You know, what does this mean? How is the master coming back? Is he some kind of cyborg, an ant, or some, some robot that thinks he's the master? Um, what's with Ood Sigma's head? All of a sudden he's got a brain? Is it, like, in the future, is that how Ood age? Has he gotten really old? Who's that, that guy who's all standing there with his arms crossed, looking all stern and sinister? Um, there's a shot of Donna on the phone, holding her head, screaming. Is she dying? Has she remembered the doctor? It's just, there's so much in that I cannot wait to see it. Um, I thought that watching, you know, I, I thought I'd be able to develop some theories about what happens by watching that, but I got no clue. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just wanted to let that off my chest, I suppose. It was, oh man, brilliant, brilliant episode. Um, and of course, like I said, the trailer, that, that trailer was better than the episode, I thought. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it's just, I love, okay, Doctor Who is just brilliant. Timey, thank you for introducing me to this show, even if you didn't know you were doing it at the time. There's never been a show that I've enjoyed watching more. <laughs> this is just awesome. Well, that's all I can think of for today. Uh, thank you for watching. This is The Law of Zack. See you later. <laughs>